The Smell of Bread, a folktale from South America. Every morning when the baker's neighbor woke up, he could smell the smell of the bread coming from the baker's bakery. Hmm, what a way to start the day. And one day he said to the baker, Baker, I have to thank you. You just get my day started wonderfully. Because in the morning when I wake up, I just... And I smell your bread and it just is a wonderful, warm way to start the day. Thank you very much. And the baker smiled. But then later that day, the baker got thinking. Wait a minute, wait a minute. My neighbor just said, he wakes up in the morning and he smells my bread and it makes his day so fine. He smells my bread in the morning. It makes his day so fine. He should pay for that. I'm a baker. He should pay me for that. I'm going to court. So the baker went to court. And here we are now in court. There's the judge. There's the baker. There's the neighbor. And a bunch of people from the village, all curious what's gonna happen. And the judge said, yes, baker. And the baker said, well, judge, I'm a baker, I guess you know. And I bake fine bread. And my neighbor here, my neighbor, just said to me the other day, he said, you know, I wake up every morning and I smell your bread. And it makes my day so fine. It makes my day so fine. And so judge, that is my living, baking. I sell bread and my neighbor smells the bread that I bake. I believe that he should be paying me for that privilege. What do you think, judge? And the judge said, hang on, uh, neighbor, what do you have to say? Is, is it true what the baker said? Well, yeah, I mean, yes, it's true. I mean, I wake up in the morning and I smell the bread baking and it's a wonderful smell. It, it sets my day up. It's very nice. And, and so I went and told him, I thanked him for, for that. And they just said, okay. Okay, here we go. Today is Monday. I want you neighbor, baker's neighbor, I want you by Friday to bring in to this court a bag of gold. What? You heard me. That's my ruling. Bring in a bag of gold this Friday. Baker, you be here. Baker's neighbor, you be here with a bag of gold. Everybody was like, oh, wow. The baker's neighbor didn't know what to do. He didn't have that kind of money. I have a small bag, but he said a bag, you know. And the neighbors started stopping by. And they gave him another coin, and another gold coin, and another, and another, and another. And by Friday, he had a bag full of gold coins. And he came into the court, and the judge said, Okay, baker's neighbor, may I see the bag of gold, please? Hand it to me. Thank you. And Baker, come up here, please. A table was brought out, and the judge emptied the bag of gold onto the table. Now, Baker, feel that gold. And the Baker picked up the gold. Oh, yes. Judge, that was a good decision. This gold, I deserve to have this gold. It feels so great in my hands. Yes, yes, yes. And the judge said, uh, but Baker, now you're through. Put the gold back into the bag and give it to the neighbor.
your neighbor. He smells your bread, and now you have felt his gold, and so you are even. Case settled. The court is closed for the day. Have a great weekend. And that's the story.